Hey guys, we're in Quakertown on the coldest day of the year so far to check out Tom's Barbecue. They're going in in the old Asian fusion place, Yellowtail. I uh, get the chance to talk to Nick, the head chef, and the two Johns, the owner and the manager. And you getting the sign done soon? Hopefully. Probably had, um, I want to say about eight or nine vendors come out and weeks. Really? Yeah, you got to follow up with all of them. Yeah. Like, it's no amazing. Way. You're trying to pay somebody, but you got to follow up yeah, nonstop. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. We got uh, the 10 taps on that side, and then over here we're going to put a kegerator of four tap. Okay, so you have uh, 14 14, taps. yeah, that's what we're looking at. And we want to do the separate one over here. We have two companies we're kind of talking with right now. One for sure, High Jinx. Is gonna oh, make nice. Us, they're going to make us our own brew. Oh, that's great. Yeah, we're trying to get our own brand. So it'll be Tom's All American, its own brand of beer. Yeah. What kind of what kind of beer are you looking to do with that? We definitely want to do one lager. Okay. And probably like one ale. Just yeah. A, a blonde ale or something. Yeah, like that. yeah. We're not doing a huge menu. The, what we're gonna serve is gonna be great. If it's not great, we just don't serve it. Yeah. It's just, we we don't need to cram a hundred things on our menu. We just need to cram. What's good? What's good? Yeah. And this isn't your first rodeo. I've worked either in a restaurant or been in it since I was like probably 10. Oh, wow. So Yeah, yeah so you come with a lot of experience. Hopefully. It sounds like the whole team has a lot of experience. No, they do, man. And that's the cool part is you put a team together of people where you lack. That's what I tell them all the time. I'm like, look, where I lack, John picks up. Where John lacks, Nick picks up. Where Nick lacks, yeah. I pick. So between the three of us, we're, we're a solid one person. Oh, but yeah. That's how you got to be. <laughs> Nobody's perfect at anything. Right? Yeah, the second yeah. somebody comes out here and tells you, that's the same thing with the chef. The second one chef tells me they're perfect at something, I'm, I'm done. Yep. I already know they're not. You can't, especially in the food industry. Yeah. If you're not changing, you're dead. The entire restaurant's corrugated steel and uh, shiplap. Kind of wanted to go for a rustic aesthetic. Oh, yeah. Rustic but refined. You know, that's kind of what we're going for. As Absolutely. Far as, as far as look, as far as the food goes too. All of our food is going to be, you know, 100% authentic, 100% smoked, everything that we can make on premises. Nice. So everything from the chicken to the briskets, everything is going to be fresh, never frozen. Okay. That's what we're going for. Fantastic. Was this all here or did you, did you guys change this? Like this guy, this wall was built uh, for us. We're actually going to separate this out uh, for special events. So oh, the, okay. Those doors right here are going to be hung right here on like a... Barn uh, style? On a slot. Yeah, exactly. Oh, very exactly. cool. Exactly. So if you come in here... Yep. Um, Notice there's a there's a pretty big space. We can private events. Uh, you know we're gonna have TVs in here so that way if somebody needs to do Absolutely. a presentation, that way we can. How know, many people? How many people do you think you could fit in here? About 50, I think. Oh wow. Yeah, I think nice. 50 people comfortably. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> and then eventually we're going to put some uh, some coin operated video game machines outside too. Oh, that's I love that idea. Yeah, yeah. It's that way, you know. Love people, that idea. People waiting. They can you got to go as classic as possible. Oh no those. question, man. No yeah. question. I think we're Nothing. doing like. Galaga Miss Pac-Man, I yeah, think. Yeah, nothing sells yeah. like nostalgia. Yep. Is Dale's Pale Ale like the work beer that you have on? Someone That's actually, working. that was here when we got <laughs> here, man. I was really excited. I'm like, I love Dale's. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You should have you should have at least one on during oh, construction, right? Oh, that, right? <laughs> I know it's freezing cold, but I can open this up and show you what I got going on in here. Yeah, we'll check it out. Smoking some onions now because the onions, the smoked onions go in the barbecue sauce. So it gives you that smoky flavor, no chemicals, no liquid smoke we're using in anything at all. So, but you can see that there. We got pork butts going? Yeah, I got some pork butts going. Nice. They're running about eight, nine hours smoke right now. Um, getting them to about 190 degrees. They pull off real nice. We're, um, we're gonna be a little different than your normal barbecue place because we're not pulling it in shreds. Okay. Um, we're gonna leave bigger chunks for your sandwich. Oh yeah. We've tried it both ways. We even feel that when we bite into the sandwich, it's a little more meatier, a little more nicer than, than all them little shreds. It was good either way. Yeah. You know? Are you able to talk at all about um, the menu? Like even just like the basic, basic stuff that yeah. you're gonna have? Okay. Chicken ribs, tri-tips, okay. um, baby back, spare ribs, St. Louis ribs, we're not sure of yet. Um, takes a special rib liker to eat them. Okay. Um, tri-tips are gonna be a big thing. Pulled pork, obviously, sandwiches. We're gonna do specialty sandwiches that aren't so much gonna be on the menu here, but we're gonna have like a social media menu that you see, you know, the, oh, the yeah, specials yeah. wise that okay. you've seen it on, you know, email list. So are you guys hiring? Are you looking for help? Yes, hostesses, bartenders, wait staff, bus boys, everything, dishwashers, everything. Perfect. Um, I need I need a sous chef, I need a prep cook, and I need a, uh, a plater and, and an expo. So uh, yeah, we're gonna be hiring a bunch of people.
perfect.